stay consistent, work hard. Don't listen to what anyone says. Do what you want to do. Fuck everyone else. What's good? It's Swisher Beats. I'm from Austin, Texas. I've been producing for eight years. Yeah, we out here. It's crazy because I'm used to like working in my crib and like just being working by myself and stuff. It wasn't really a shift. It was like, I'm comfortable with my sound. I know I got a good sound. I know I got the beats. So it wasn't that bad. I've learned that you got to be quick on the spot. You got to listen to what the artist says and kind of feel the room. That'll always be number one because that's what makes the most money. That's what I like doing as well, e-commerce. Um, it's always number one. I've only recently started chasing placements because I just want to try something new. The B store is always number one. Man, just networking, being at these events and having a your own sound. Stop trying to chase what's trending. Just be unique, stand out. That's all you need to do. Having a unique sound I don't try to chase mainstream sounds. I make what I feel, what I like, what I hear. And I feel like that's just what brought me here is having that unique sound that a lot of people don't have. And they might have it, but they don't want to do it because it's not mainstream. Y'all have been extremely important. I probably would have not been able to get any of my publishing without y'all. And your team, your support team is insane. Y'all always answer every question. Y'all are always there. I honestly would probably would never sign with anyone else but y'all. Man, just treating it like a 9 to 5. If you have a schedule and you stick to that, you don't go off the schedule, you don't add to the schedule, you'll put yourself in a routine that works for you. Me personally, I work Monday through Friday about 8 to 9 hours a day and then I take Saturday and Sunday off. And I've been on that schedule for 5, 6 years now. That's helped me stay consistent, not fall off as far as my sound. Having a daughter is, that's motivated me to go harder, make more money, provide for them. It's crazy. It's like a light switch that turned on. It's insane. I would absolutely encourage them. I wouldn't force them, but I would definitely show them like, this is what you can do. I would teach them everything I know. That would be crazy. <laughs> Man, y'all have truly changed my life. I've been fortunate enough to, to not have to work a job in like the past five years and earning a living off what I love to do. It's a blessing and truly thankful for everything. I wanna see more collaborations for sure, definitely. And when we are seeing that a lot, a lot more collab, I'm, I'm personally collaborating more than I ever have and it's it's been amazing. I love the way, the way that B-Stars is going right now. Y'all are doing everything perfect. Before, maybe a year ago, I really only collaborated with a few people, a few different producers. I was really close-minded about that. Um, I always thought I had to make everything myself. And after I started collaborating, it just opened up a lot of crazy doors I was sleeping on. Hey, you just gotta like push yourself because you're gonna box yourself in. It's hard for me to do interviews, but I'm not going to learn unless I do it. It's like riding a roller coaster. You're not going to you're not going to like it unless you do it. Some of my future goals is keep on doing what I'm doing, grow my business, my B-Star store. I'm definitely going to have some huge placements this year. Yeah, just keep on doing what I'm doing. Stay consistent, work hard. Don't listen to what anyone says. Do what you want to do fuck everyone else <laughs> don't listen to what anyone says make what you want post what you want be unique that's all